Hi everyone, in this short tips and tricks video, we're going to have a look at how we can add some validation into an app and more specifically into a text input control and we can add some um, red borders so we know when we are in the range or out of range. So let's jump right into it. Okay, so I have an app that I've built, which is a reward and recognition app. And as a user, uh, I can nominate one of my colleagues for helping me or for good work, for instance. And so when the user is logging into the app, um, we have um, the nominations um, that we've made and we can see the status. We have some, um, uh, some filters at the top where we can filter uh, by statuses. Um, but what we're going to be focusing on is when we go into the nominate screen. So this is a very simple layout and we can uh, nominate somebody, uh, add the line manager, and then we have um, the reward provider and reward values. So those are stored in SharePoint where I have a list, which is reward values, and I have um, a couple of shops with some uh, predefined values. So let's go back into the app. And if I select curries, for instance, I have a drop down with the values. And if I select Amazon, this is where I can enter the value myself. So there's a hint text that says a number between one and 100. So it means that if I'm out of this range, then I want my borders to be red to um, tell the user that this is not good. Um, so if I enter three, uh, which would be really mean, uh, then I'm good to go. And if I enter um, 900, then we are out of the range. So the borders are red. So let's put the app in edit mode and we're going to create a new screen and I'm going to zoom in and we're going to add um, just a text input. Zoom in a little bit more, maybe. Um, we don't want anything for the default. What we want to add is a hint text. So if we're going to advanced, we can search for a hint. And then here we're going to put enter a value between, if I can spell that right, um, between one and 100. And currently this is uh, with a border blue. So we're going to go into border color, uh, select the control, go into border color. And then this is what we have uh, currently. So we're going to keep that, but we're going to add a condition. So if, and remember we are entering text basically, but we want to compare values. And so the text should be an integer. So we're going to use the um, value function. So the text input, which is text input one. So text input one dot text is less than one. So is equal to zero. We're going to have this border or if the same thing, and I forgot my parentheses here. So the same thing, but this time is greater than 100, then we want the border to be red. Otherwise, we want to keep it as blue. And I'm going to close the parentheses for the if statement, and this is what we have. So it's currently red because we're out of the range. And if we play the app and we add um, 50, 58, then we're good to go. And if we have um, 167, then we're not happy. So the border is red. So that's it for today. I hope this video has been informative and I'll see you in the next video.